evening. I'm Jennifer Lee. And I'm Josh Benson. Thanks for being with us tonight. Well, a massive organized crime operation brought down by Polk County detectives. After a nearly two-year investigation, seven people are now facing racketeering charges accused of running a high-end electronics theft ring. And as Melissa Marino explains, they targeted Walmart stores all over Polk County and beyond. Good evening. We're told that these experienced criminals hit Walmarts in 26 different counties. They hit this Walmart here on South Florida Avenue two times, making off with cartfuls of expensive electronics. They aren't your average shoplifters. These seven people are looking at decades behind bars for racketeering. They're experienced criminals and they're organized to steal. They're accused of running a high-end electronics theft ring, either boldly walking out with electronics stuffed in bags or sometimes more sneaky. So they would do things like put them in boxes of diapers and seal the box back, go through, scan the box for the diaper co cost, put it in the bag, and walk out of the store. And then turn around and sell it. $178,000 worth of merchandise total. And you know who pays for that? Not Walmart. You do as the consumer. Low life. Jerry Mills shops at Walmart and wasn't too happy to hear about it. it makes the prices go up on everything else. And these crooks hit Walmart stores all over Polk County. Detectives worked with other agencies and the state for more than two years to catch them. Now, four suspects are in the Polk County jail. Three of them are still on the run. Sheriff Grady Judd had a message for anyone thinking of getting in the business of stealing. So keep your sticky fingers out of the store unless you want to go to the county jail. And we don't have nothing to steal from there except orange jumpsuits. Crime Stoppers is offering a $2,000 reward for each of the three people still on the run. We have more information on our website, WFLA.com. In Lakeland, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.